CERN and their Large Haldron Collider. I've spoke about this before. Now they are ramping up here to conduct this testing here next week where they're taking these atoms and smashing them together in search of these miniature black holes. Now many people theorize they could, you know, bust a hole in space-time and suck us all in and destroy everything. Other people say this is the potential for a stargate opening here. Now there's a lot of theories out here as to what they're going to achieve here in the end. But one thing's for sure. They've caught on to this God particle and they're in search for the answers of dark matter. Saying that this dark matter is what is found most in the universe. And if you can't understand that dark matter, then you're never going to understand the universe. Now with that said, this brings up a lot of different things that can happen. Like I said, it could blow sky high, rip a hole in space-time, open a stargate, things of that nature. But they're set to start this next week. This thing has now doubled its payload when it comes to power. Okay, And there's not another facility on the planet that comes close to touching this facility in Switzerland. Okay, So... You know, what, what can happen here? I guess we'll just have to sit back and wait and see. But it is very interesting when you talk about stargates, things of that nature. I've been looking into other planets and to anomalies on planets. I should probably do a whole other video on talking about the 19th parallel. I think this is key because what is found here on all these different planets that you will see is there is this massive energy vortex in these regions. Here on Earth, you will find El Popo in Mexico, Popocato, where, you, where they see all these UFOs going in and out of the volcano. How can that be? It's happening, though. You go to the 19th parallel on Mars, guess what you come to? The most massive volcano in the whole solar system, Olympus Mons, okay? Towers like three times higher than Mount Everest sits. It's just massive. You go to the 19th parallel in the southern hemisphere on Jupiter, and guess what you find? The Great Red Spot. You see, there's something there when it comes to certain features of this planet, and they know that. That's why you could draw a line all the way around this planet, and you can go right through all these ancient places, all these pyramids. The pyramids, collecting the inertia of the planet. Laying on these ley lines, these energy lines across the planet, harnessing it. See? And they always say, how deep does the rabbit hole go? Well, what if that rabbit hole brings you out in a plush land? Allah inner earth, Allah Agartha. The story of Alice in Wonderland. And yes, Sometimes the truth can be stranger than fiction. I'm going to leave a link with more information. Just wanted to touch on this. And I'm going to have to do another video here, it seems. I want to on this 19th parallel and showing the connection here between all these different planets. Till next time, this has been Dabu7. Peace.